2 Works for You Weather, sponsored by Executive Homes. Good morning. Happy 4th of July. A lot of you up at the lakes right now. I think Shangri-La camera right now. Good morning to you guys. Yes, we are celebrating the 4th for today. You're wondering how is your forecast shaping up? And let me tell you, I've got a real treat for you. But first, let's go ahead and pull in some of those lake levels that we're seeing right now. Keystone up uh, with 14 feet. You can see Fort Gibson closer, almost 17 feet above where they should be. Uh, for those of you over in Grand right now, not too bad with those levels uh, after all that rainfall that we saw. So hopefully you're having a wonderful time as you're uh, up there right now and continuing to have another enjoyable day. Let's talk about what we're seeing on radar. We are quiet here in Tulsa, but you could see a little bit of green showing up just over portions of Ponca City on that I-35 area. And that's when we're seeing a few pop-up showers, but they are breaking up really quickly and they're not going to be in our area. I can tell you that. So that's some welcome news. Lots of sun as you're looking out using our Renaissance Hotel camera. Let's talk about what we're seeing for today. It's 74 already here for Tulsa. So temperatures are on the rise for today. Southwesterly winds are in play. Those will be guiding out the south and then southeast by this afternoon, and that's going to tap into more tropical like air mass. When we say that, that's going to increase not only those temperatures a little bit, but that dew point right there. That's what we're watching. So it's going to feel as we head into the afternoon, a little bit more muggy than what we had yesterday. 74 here for Tulsa, 71 over in Muskogee. Good morning to you guys. Ponca City coming in at 72. We are seeing 160 still hanging on, and that's for Rogers, but you guys will be joining us in those 70s here very soon. 87 as we head into the afternoon, 88. You're thinking those temperatures are pretty nice for this time of the year, but with those humidity levels on the rise, we will continue to feel like those mid 90s, and even some areas could be feeling more like upper 90s by this afternoon. If you're going to be outdoors, please stay hydrated. 88 for your high here for Tulsa. Again, those southeasterly winds will be returning. In terms of that comfort meter for today, dew points, I do expect those to be in that 70 to 75 range by this afternoon. Right now, we are in that 67 range with, that, uh, with those dew points. So it's feeling muggy out there. Um, starting to feel muggy out there, I should say. But we have that humidity around, and that will continue to be on the rise. That's the only difference out of what we had yesterday where we saw those dew points a little bit lower. We're keeping a few clouds around. Yes, over in Shangri-La, you can see Great Lake where you have those clouds with us right now, but those will break apart as you're getting that boat out by about 11 a.m. even into that noon hour. Check this out. We are seeing plenty of sunshine across the board. A few high clouds in the passing. South winds will be in play. Again, they will be sustained about 5 to 10 miles per hour. A few clouds as we head into the evening hours, but this is an ideal setup for a firework display, especially for this time of the year. Temperatures this evening, again, we'll stay on the warmer side. It will be muggy out there. Sunset at 845. Fireworks will be going off right about that 9 o'clock hour. And into the evening, you can see temperatures remaining in those 80s, so we will be staying dry. No issues weather-wise. 65 for your overnight low. And as we look towards our Monday, still I know a lot of you might have the day off for your Monday. 90 will do it. 89 down in Okmulgee, and this is going to start the stretch of 90 degree weather returning to the forecast, but not too bad. 91. We've had worse. Yeah. We've had we've had worse already this year, but look at what happens by this time next weekend. We'll get a passing cold front. Julie, this <coughs> high temperature what we're looking at for a week from today. Uh -huh. Lower 80s. Back low, lower 80s. Lower 80s. So we'll hit 87 and right now we're looking at highs by Sunday of next week. 82. That's really, I mean, considering this is typically our hottest time of the year, pretty nice. And I liked how confidently you said no issues. None. I None. love it. No issues weather-wise. Weather-wise, that is. Yeah. <laughs> Otherwise, <laughs> yeah, can't, I Annie can't help you out. <laughs> yeah, I, I, <laughs> <laughs> All right. We'll be back with one last look at your forecast in just minutes. <laughs> Good morning. Coming up on a special edition of Meet the Press.